Hey YouTube and welcome to my next review. This time it is of the R93 T2, the new GP Crate Sniper Rifle. Um, now, like I just said, this sniper rifle is available um, in GP crates, not ZB. It's a miracle, I know. <laughs> I'm not crazy, at least, maybe, I don't know, but uh, yeah, it's a GP crate item, which is uh, really nice in and of itself. But uh, a lot of people compare this sniper rifle to the AWM. Um, a lot of people say it's better than the AWM, and I'm going to have to agree with that, but only with the regular AWM. Um, and I'll get into my reasoning why and compare it to also the DSR and all that. Uh, because this sniper rifle shares traits from both the DSR and the AWM. So, um, as far as power, it's slightly more powerful than the AWM and the DSR, but it's only noticeable if you hit the leg, and it does a magnificent extra 2 damage to the leg at 83 damage, while the uh, AWM and DSR do around 81 damage. Um, other than that, it's a one-hit kill everywhere else at any range. Uh, that's basically a standard for uh, lots of uh, single-shot sniper rifles. Uh, that are mainly used, and look at this guy, I think he actually does night for me, yes he does, <laughs> nice, and you're a second lieutenant buddy, proud of you, um, <laughs> um, as far as box damage goes, this is where um, the R93 um, is a lot like the DSR, as it, is in ha as it, ha yeah, as it has the same uh, damage uh, through the box as the DSR, um, which it does 99 damage to the head through the box, which is really disappointing. It looks like uh, the AWM is a clear winner as it is a one-shot headshot through a box. Um, so that's where uh, the AWM does have an advantage in that box situation. So if your guy goes hiding behind a box, you shoot him, you hit him in the head, he comes out and kills you, and then you see you did 99 damage, you're like, damn it, I wish I had the AWM. <laughs> In that situation, um, so yeah, that's uh, everywhere else except the head. It's going to be two shots to kill through the box, except the legs where it's going to be three shots. Um, other than that, um, it's not the best sniper, obviously, for the box situation. It's not wall bang like the M700. Um, so let's get into uh, ammo. That's really the big, biggest uh, flaw of this gun. It only has four shots, and this is where um, I believe where the, this is better, where the AWM is, what game mode you really play. Um, overall, I think this is better than the regular AWM, but if you play a lot of prison, like um, I am right here where most of my sniper reviews are, um, if you play a lot of prison, I have to say the regular AWM, is better than this one because you're gonna be reloading a lot um, as I was in this video um, you only have four shots um, compared to the regular HLM that has five um, but if you play a lot of games like search and destroy or something like that where you really don't need as much ammo unless you uh, you know encounter the whole team and you're trying to get that six-man feed and uh, you gotta reload <laughs> but um, on a regular search and destroy game um, I would uh, say this is the better weapon because it's simply I believe this uh, shoots slightly faster um, and it, it has a faster reload speed than the AWM um, but and I this versus the DSR I think this is also better than the DSR but it's simply because I'm not a big fan of the DSR um, most people aren't there are some people who are a fan of the DSR and it's not the DSR's fault, it's mine, I really just, ugh, something again, <laughs> I don't know, I just, I'm just not as good with the DSR, but um, now let's get into the variants of the AWM. Any variant, um, I think, like the AWM camo, or any variant that has 10 shots in it, is much better than the R93, to be honest, in any mode, because specifically, like the AWM camo and the uh, what well, I think the liquid metal has the and look at this glitch right here. <laughs> I got bumped into the wall, um, and it was uh, really pretty cool. It's my first time actually going through the wall in prison, uh, but I uh, forgot. Remember to like, oh yeah, I'm doing a review here. So, <laughs> um, but any variant of the 
AWM, like AWM Camo, um, or any ones that have a faster reload. Um, AWM Red Dragon, it's still a personal preference. It's uh, the ones that have the regular reload speed. Um, you could, uh, it's really personal at that point, uh, which one is better, again, basing on what you play the most. But variants that have the faster reload, I'd say those are much better because you have more ammo, you have uh, six, six more shots than this thing, and you have a faster reload uh, than the R93. Um, so in all honesty, if you have something like an AWM camo or a the Advanced Xmas or any other version that has the faster reload, um, I say stick with that. I mean, if, but if you only have the regular AWM, um, then this is uh, much better in my opinion. So that's really going to be it for this review, guys. Uh, did end up losing here. <laughs> and the final score I got was 24 and 12. Uh, so I want to thank thank I'm a Trollzer for letting me use his account. Uh, a lot of people letting me use their account for reviews. I want to thank everyone. Remember, I don't steal your account info. I don't buy, you know, I don't waste your GP or your ZP. The only thing I change is the crosshair and the sensitivity. Um, and I usually change that back. So, again, guys, uh, I want to thank you for watching. If you want to know the IGN, just look in the kill feed. Thank you guys for watching, and see you next time.